Good morning, everyone. Today is. I gotta bend down a little bit. Today is February 27th, 7 a.m., 7:01 a.m., and today is induction day. So what that means is Baby K can come. First of all, I didn't even like. I disappeared after I posted my announcement on YouTube. Sorry about that. It was just this pregnancy was kind of a lot to be trying to do YouTube. It was just not the right time and place for me personally but i'm back with this labor and delivery vlog for y'all and i hope y'all enjoy it so let's start with that so yeah like i was saying baby k should be here today or tomorrow whichever he decides i won't be mad either way which one we're just getting ready to leave we're gonna leave out at like 7 15 because we're like 10 minutes away from the hospital we have to be there at 7 30. i can't bend over like this no more so yeah, I'm just finishing up packing. I have to just pack some outfits, that's it. I gotta get dressed first. Gotta pack some outfits, we gotta load up the car. We got his car seat over here, needing to be taken out. To prepare for labor, I just put my hair in two braids because like right before I start pushing, I'm just gonna take the braids out so it can be curly and it won't look hot mess. And I just pluck my eyebrows a little bit he tired y'all but yeah that's it and i'm just gonna vlog this whole process and hopefully y'all enjoy it so stay tuned we about to get ready load up the car and i will see y'all when we get to the hospital morning i have a scheduled induction for 7 30. Oh, anastasia greg g-r-e-g-g -G. um so you're gonna go uh that last big poster mm -hmm. take a uh, left around it walk next to the stairs to the back there's an elevator take that up to two okay thank you you're welcome um is there anything to like bring all of our stuff up or like does he have to just like bring it in one by one um, like a car or something. Okay, thank you. Have you been on anybody in the last two weeks that's been positive for COVID? No. Okay, so we just got to our room. We got a big room, period. A bigger room, I guess. And we just about to put all of our stuff away in a closet. Oh my God. I've been waiting to see this. To this little diaper. So this where I sleep at. This me right here. It's a bed right there, and it's that little chair right there. Um, he and my mom gonna have to rock paper scissors who sleeps in the bed, I guess. So I'm gonna get ready and put on my gown. And yeah. Okay, I'm all changed into my gown. I don't like this gown, boot it all out. So yeah, I'm just waiting for my nurses to come back in and let me keep y'all updated. My last little 
光。Okay, so it is currently like 9.50. 8. Yeah, 8.50, like what, 4? 8.54 or 8.55. Um, usually you're up at the top of the uterus. Okay. Have you been feeling contractions at all? No. So the, what, what contractions start out is, is I might come in here and say, you feel those contractions? You're like, no. And then it'll go from your feet might. So they came in and put on my the heartbeat monitor and the contractions monitor. And I'm having contractions. I just don't feel them. So yeah, um they put the monitors on, they drew blood twice, and then they put my IV in. And then they gave me a menu to order some breakfast. Thank God, because I'm starving and I got a headache. I thought I was about to be starving all day. So I ordered me some breakfast and pancakes, just waiting on that. And then I'm about to just watch TV until my breakfast come and then probably take a nap after they get done, like check in and all that stuff. Oh yeah, just a little update. He going to sleep. Sleepy head. And I'm waiting on my mom. She should be here in like 20 minutes. She's just getting into town from Michigan. Oh so yeah, that's it. About to have a baby. I need to find some TikToks to do. Cause I've been saving a lot of like TikToks to do, but like I haven't been like doing them. So let me find some fun ones to do. Um, while before, like while I'm still pregnant, like before I have him and stuff. So yeah. All right, so they just brought my breakfast in and they just checked, I mean, they checked my cervix first and then my breakfast came in. So I got checked last week at the clinic and I was only one centimeter dilated and I'm still one centimeter dilated. And they said I'm 50% effaced and baby is still kind of high. So they gonna give me like some medicine to like soften it up some more, I guess. So I'm gonna eat my breakfast. I got some pancakes. They look a little burnt. Pancakes, bacon, I should've ordered some eggs. They gave me orange juice, I wanted apple juice, excuse me. The hell? Then I just got a blueberry muffin and a banana, so I'm gonna fuck it up real quick. Just a little update. Um, after I ate breakfast, they gave me a pill. I forgot what it was called. But they like gave me a pill to soften up my cervix. And it didn't budge. I was still at a one. I'm trying not to wake people up because Katie and my mom is asleep. So yeah, they gave me the first pill. Didn't work. Still out of one. So they gave me a second one about two hours ago. And I just woke up from like two naps because I really didn't get no sleep last night. Probably gonna take another one before they wake me back up and check me again at six and then I'll get to eat again, thank God, before they put me on the Pitocin. I'm having contractions. Not very painful, just like feel like cramps almost and pressure. Katie is knocked out over there. My mother. It's just a little bit what's been going on the past about four hours. I don't think I recorded any after I ate. I'm still sleepy. This bed is not comfy at all. My back hurts. I've been working real hard trying to get comfy and fall asleep. Those contractions still going very, very frequent. 
chakras feel cramps. Yeah. Should have been rocking my hair the first time. She didn't know how to do it. So, so I was just looking. I was looking. Hey y'all. What time is it? It's 9.51. It's 11.51, almost 12 a.m. The next day, another update, just checking in. I'm not gonna talk too much because, ooh, he's kicking. I'm not gonna talk too much because like when I was watching labor and delivery vlogs, I hate it when they just talk hella. So I'ma just update y'all, let y'all know what's going on. They gave me, first they gave me the two, what is it called, Cytotec, I think. The two pills. And, and my cervix to soften it up that didn't work so i started bouncing on the ball to get him down because i am i was at a negative three station which means he's still a little high up let me hold it like i don't know where to hold it um i was still a negative three station which means he's a little bit high up so i was trying to get him to come down but like as soon as I started like it wasn't when I was bouncing on the ball it was like after I they had me lay down because my um my contractions were one to two minutes apart one minute apart like they were coming quick 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 so they had me lay down to like kind of slow them down a little bit and that's when I really started to feel the contractions like they started to hurt real bad not unbearably bad but like they were getting more painful than they were so that was about 8 30 ish and then they decided to give me the balloon up there i'll insert a picture if y'all don't know like what it looks like and stuff they gave me that balloon it hurted like it was so some people say it's uncomfortable but like it hurted to me like it was real painful it felt like real sharp cramps real sharp something like when it was inflated like it wasn't too painful while they were putting it in but like while they were fill filling up the balloons with water jesus christ i cried oh my god but my mom was there holding my hand the whole time so i got the balloons and then i asked for some pain medicine they gave me that immediately after and it started to feel better it made me real drowsy and sleepy. So now it's 12 o'clock by now. And they gave me the Pitocin at 11.30. And they said I had to wait two hours for the pain medicine, but I'm not really in too much pain. So I'm gonna try to wait a little bit before I get it. And that's just where we're at right now. I don't know how fast or how slow I'm gonna dilate. I was still a one, which is why they gave me the balloon i was still one centimeters dilated so we'll see what happens with this pitocin how fast i dilate hopefully it gets stuff going because i'm ready for it to be over at this point i was real nervous at the beginning lots of adrenaline just thinking of like probably just thinking of the worst you know that can happen but everything hasn't been that bad not too much unbearable pain i'm not really feeling the real painful contraction as like everybody describes and talks about not feeling that yet i'm planning on getting the epidural as soon as i get to four centimeters maybe five if i can make it um as soon as the balloon falls out because the balloon comes out when you get to four Okay, they can come check me right about now. I said they can come check me right about now. Still out of five. 
like 7 35 a.m and as soon as my iv goes out i'm about to get an epidural because i just can't do it i can't do it no more it hurt it hurt contractions did slow down though thank god I decided to sit on a ball because I didn't want to lay down. Like it feels like it hurts worse when I lay down. So I'm just rocking back and forth. I'm looking rough right now. It's okay because these braids gonna come down in a second. I'm looking swollen. Everything. Scared, just really relax. Push your back into my thumb the best you can. There you go. And relax your right shoulder a little bit more. There you go. Alright, so right here is where I'm gonna put this numbing medicine. I'm gonna warn you before it goes in, okay? But it is gonna feel like a little pinch and a burn. Okay, so another update. Last clip. We got a little bit of me getting the epidural. They didn't really let her, they told her she couldn't record, but she got a little bit, so I cried. I was so nervous to get it. It's kind of scary, especially for the first time. So yeah, I cried. Kitty held my hand, made me feel a little better and relaxed. So I got the epidural. I'm six centimeters now, and it is, what time is it? Nine. 20 and let me switch arms got the catheter in the pain of the epidural i would say it was like a i would say it was like a six like it wasn't so bad but it was still kind of like what the hell katie and my mom left to go take a shower and get some breakfast because i don't want to watch them eat no thank you i only can eat ice chips not fun at all so yeah, I'm just in here and I'm about to take a nap because I'm real sleepy. Hopefully when I wake up, it will be time to push. I'm literally all hooked up everywhere. Like everywhere hooked up. I cannot move. I can't feel my legs. Can't feel nothing. Hi, can you oh, send? I hear a beep, honey. Okay. Yeah, I'll let you know when I'm coming. Oh, oh, oh. I'm going on yellow. I'm going on yellow. Right there. Three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten. Deep breath in. And come on. And push. One, two, three, four. Right there. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. You okay? You okay? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Look, give me some ice. Oh, my little dear. You pass out, look, she didn't want to kill you because <laughs> 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 Yeah, it's, it's, it's a real baby. Full head of hair, mama. Full head of hair. <laughs> 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 oh, he's so close. He's so close. She seems like a robot. She probably was. Oh, he got a lot of hair. Good luck. Let me go grab Diane, too. I know, I know it, but I'm like, she's totally down the way. Uh -huh. Here. <laughs> this is how this is Where'd you go? All them legs, though? Oh, yeah, you get to be right in there. This is your job. This is your job. You've got the leg duty. And awesome. then you got baby duty. <laughs> and then you got duty duty. <laughs> See, I got you right there. See, I got all the duty. Oh. Mama. Two. Three. Keep going. Four. Keep going. Five. Keep going. Six. Keep going. Seven. Keep going. Eight. Right there, Mama. Right there. Nine. Ten. Right back in. Right back in. Right back in. Right back in. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Right there. Right there. Right there. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Seven. You got it, babe. You got it. Nine. Right back in. Come on, Mama. Deep breath. Go. Push him out. Push him out. Right there, Carol. Right there. Right there. Three. Come on. Four, Come on. Five. There you go. Six, there you go. Seven. Push him out. Get him out of there. And breathe. Slow and deep breath, Mama. Slow and deep breath. And breathe. Slow and easy. Oh, I can't breathe. I can't Slow breathe. Slow deep breath. Yep. You oh, gotta down. focus. You have to focus. Slow <sighs> deep breaths. Come on, Kai, please. Hey, let's go. Come on, Mama. Deep breath in. Okay. And got push. It. Come on. Got it. Good push. Right there. Push. Right there. Right there. Good. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. And breathe. <coughs> Deep breath. Come on, Mama. You go back at it. Give push. us a good push. Come on. Push. Right there. More there. More there. More there. More there. More there. Keep going, babe. Keep going. Keep going. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out. He right there. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Come on. Keep going. There you go. Come on. Right there. Keep push through that paint. Push through that paint. Keep going. Push through that paint. Right there, Mama. Right there. Breathe. Get out. Get out. Get nope. Out. Deep breath. You gotta push. Come on. Push. Push. You gotta help him. You gotta help him. Push. Keep going. Right there. Right there. Get him out. There he comes. Oh, He's coming. He's coming. You gotta get him out. Push, man. Push. Oh. He's here. Oh. <laughs> you did it. Oh. You did it. Hold on one second. Yeah. He's gonna be warm. Hold on one second, though. Yeah. Let's just give him a second here. Six nineteen. Sorry. Yeah. Uh oh. About to cry. Come on. There he goes. He's a peanut. Yeah, he is. Holy crap. Yeah. <laughs> Loose, yeah. It was kind of like a... a Body-ish almost, it looked like. Yeah, like it was kind of braided. Okay. Oh, I'm going to clamp. I'll show you where, okay? Congratulations. Wait a minute. You did it, Mama. Once he's, once he's free, we're just gonna take him over there and get some of this gunk out we can hear, okay? okay? Dad, right between the two here. See that? In between those two. Yep. Yep. 
Oh, yeah. 